All right, well, uh, yet another great place to stay in uh, Thailand. This is the uh, River River Kwai Resort. It resides, uh, well, it sits right on the River Kwai. And there's a ultra-famous bridge deals with uh, World War II and slave labor, all those things that nobody really wants to talk about anymore. Um, and uh, great place. Staff was ultra nice. Uh, we checked in really, really late. Actually got here around uh, 1030 at night, um, and they still had somebody at the desk, welcomed us in, showed us to the room, uh, give you an umbrella. So it's uh, definitely a pretty cool, pretty cool room. Really, really modern kind of uh, deck decor. Um, really neat uh, little coffee station with the hot pot there. They have wine available in the room as well as beer, which I thought was really, really cool. I haven't stayed at a resort that's done that yet. Uh, the menu, if you wanted to order something from the kitchen, but we were we got in too late, and then they actually offer a buffet breakfast that's included um, they give you a little price menu for all the beer and everything that they have uh, another cool thing is not only do they put the wine in the room but they put uh, beer right there in the fridge for you so uh, really really neat uh, TV worked it was okay I mean it's a hotel TV um, the basket had all of our towels in it. Um, <clears throat> bed was okay, fairly comfortable. I've been having uh, some some neck issues, so that's uh, you know neither here nor there. But uh, yeah, bed was okay. Uh, washroom, sink there. That's me shooting a video. Um, great landscape uh, as well. Just like all the places I've stayed so far here in Thailand, everything is really green, green really lush. Um, uh, great pressure in the toilet, but they also say, you know, don't flush any, uh, any of the paper. Uh, really neat doors to the washroom. Uh, they close half and half like that. Um, Let's see if I can get that in view. Yeah, it's a little tough because it's kind of dark in here. Um, but there's a latch that actually slides back and forth as the door locks. So um, some privacy, but uh, you can see there's a little crack in there. But for two people, and uh, you know, if you're with somebody that you're with or whatnot, perfect place to stay. Um, Shower is uh, plenty large. Nice little alcove to put all of your soap. Uh, water pressure was good. Nice shower head. Uh, standard heat heater right there at the shower. Excuse me. Um, they do provide a ton of paper, so that's always a good thing for us guys. Uh, really neat floor, concrete mixed with tile. Air conditioning worked famously well. Uh, they had it turned down to about 20 degrees Celsius, which was a little too cold for me, but I didn't find that out till about 4 a.m. when it got really cold. So I had to wake up and turn it uh, turn it up a little bit, a little bit too cold for me. But uh, yeah, cool little cool little pillows there. Um, bed's naturally not made like it always isn't for these videos, but uh, I slept in it last night. Let's uh, take a look outside. Stepping outside, really nice, uh, nice grounds. I mean, really well manicured. Uh, the staff was constantly working on uh, on the garden areas here. All different kinds of uh, plants. Straight down this path is where we actually had breakfast, right on the River Kwai. Uh, buffet breakfast, standard uh, standard stuff. They had small omelets. The pancakes were absolutely fantastic. 
Uh, coffee was really good as well. So uh, I'm going to stop it here and then I'll take a quick walk down to the river and show you that. So making our way, making my way down the path here. Um, you can see the other bungalows there. They have bungalows and buildings, uh, apartment style buildings. So uh, you have your option. Both costed actually the same exact price. So I opted for the bungalow just because I like a little bit more privacy. Uh, beautiful trees, beautiful flowers everywhere. Um, love being out in nature. So we came right up this path and this is where they actually served breakfast this morning. Um, again, staff was really, really nice. Uh, breakfast was absolutely delicious. Coffee was good too. Um, it's the, uh, the tables there for the, for the buffet that they had laid out. Really nice. I mean, they go, they always go through a lot of work here in Thailand. It's always nice to see. And then uh, this is the view for breakfast. This is absolutely amazing right along the river. You see the boats there that are uh, cruising by. Really interesting boats. Then it goes right down. You can see the bridge over the river right there. So it's a, just a beautiful view. Beautiful place. Really great stay. So they come. The sky is absolutely amazing. Great little swing you can sit out there. Um, beautiful stonework uh, in the gardens everywhere. You'll see this. You'll see this all over Thailand. Uh, from the Khmer Empire, similar, very similar to what uh, what you'll see at Angkor Wat, That's the ladies there. If you watch some of those uh, videos uh, that I posted, you'll see a lot of those really neat, uh, really neat carvings. Uh, during breakfast, they played some really soft piano music, so that was nice to wake up to. Really nice to relax. Uh, separate washroom right there right off of the buffet, so <clears throat> very, very neat place to stay. Highly recommend it, especially for the price and the free, uh, or the included buffet, because it's not free, it's just included in the price. And it's always good when you're traveling, you know, I've noticed, especially this time around Thailand, I, I enjoyed having breakfast included. Uh, it's, it's nice, you know, not to have to find something and uh, find something that's on the street and you know um, during midday end of the day having you know barbecued chicken and things like that is uh, you know it's great but uh, during the morning you love to have some eggs and some juice they have fantastic orange juice in Thailand um, when you get here you'll see that it's uh, it's absolutely delicious it's it's an electric like orange color it doesn't even look like regular orange juice in the United States it's completely different. Uh, they have a pool. You'll hear some talking here. There's some people here at the pool. I'm not going to get a shot of them or try not to anyway, but um, but yeah, there's a, a pool area. Very large pool uh, in a, right in amongst the bungalows. So and There's the pool. I'm going to pan away because there's people there. Uh, the reception area is here. Nice uh, place to sit. Great little statues as well. This is the entrance. That's the reception desk right there. And then the, the formal the formal entrance from the street. I'm sure you saw the motor, the motorcycles uh, whipping by there. So great little place. It was a wonderful stay. It really was really nice. Uh, 
River Kwai Bridge Resort. And that's uh, no lie because you just saw the bridge right here. So thanks again for uh, tuning in and checking out the video. I hope you're getting good information about Thailand and uh, makes you want to come and stay here um, and enjoy these people. They're very hospitable, very nice. So mydamntrip.com, taking you places.